D Slay Reptiles. Everything live, everything exotic, everything exciting. This is my baby girl, my Mexican black king snake. Her name is Solar. Uh, you know her. She's that little spaghetti noodle string that I had a while back. Now she has a little size to her, but she's still a baby. But she has had an upgrade since you last seen her. She's now in a 40 gallon breeder. That will be her final size, her final destination, unless she reaches seven feet, and I doubt she would do that. And uh, she's gonna feed today. We're gonna feed her a fuzzy. I do have her still on her five day schedule. When she reaches 18 months, we will go to seven days, but not a day sooner. So let you get a little peek at her little setup. Pretty cool setup. She has three hides. She has a now crocodile skull hide back here on the cool side. Mid cool side, we have a primal skull. And on her hot side, sitting directly on the heat, she has her cave and she loves it. She can climb. She has adequate hiding. Uh, she thrives pretty well. Um, she's doing great. So let's see if she wants to eat. King snakes, king snakes are known for eating, and they like eating other snakes, lizards, uh, but usually captive, we do rodents, so you can't mix it up, though, on your discretion. Let's see if she wants to eat. Sleepy head. I don't know if she's not hungry today. Pick up mama so you can eat. Wake her up a little bit. I usually don't like to bother when she's in her hide, but it's feeding time, so.
before we get her out. Now this is just so awesome right here because we're basically watching nature at its finest. We're watching a Mexican black king snake eat through the eye socket of a crocodile now monitor. And these are replica squaws. They're not real squaws. But that just, it just looks so cool. Beautiful, beautiful. Let you get a full view of it. <laughs> I'm gonna watch the full process because king snakes eat rather fast. Have them swallowed <laughs> less than a minute. And they do the same thing when they're feeding on snakes. Uh, they'll slurp them down really fast. Always be careful, never break, never uh, house them together. You'll never want two in the same housing because the bigger one will eat the smaller one. But as you can see, she hasn't, she's not having any problems knocking down this fuzzy. I took her off uh, pinkies maybe a week early when she was smaller. It just wasn't satisfying there, so I uh, went up to the fuzzies, and she's been great ever since. So there you have it. That's my Mexican black king snake. Her name is Solar. She is now about six months. It reached maturity around 18 months. She'll be able to produce babies, maybe two and a half. So I appreciate you for joining in and thank you. And hope to see you soon. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and tell your friends about me. All right. You have a great day. And love and preserve Mother Nature. Thank you.